Hey, good morning all, Darren Padgett, uh, Senior SO out at Dandenong. So this morning, uh, about 10 past 3, we were called to a house fire in Agawa Road in Noble Park. We had uh, quite a few exchange calls. So when we arrived on scene, we had uh, the garage at the back uh, fully involved and which had spread into the, uh, the roof of the adjoining property. Uh, the property out the back where the shed is is all full of uh, solar panel batteries and uh, all sorts of uh, uh, flammable liquids and, and so forth. The uh, owner of the house has a lot of uh, stuff he's collected over the years, so it's quite a large junk pile. Uh, in the roof of the house there's a mezzanine floor, which has made it very di difficult for us to get to, so we've had to do an external attack on there, uh, smashing the roof tiles in, trying to get into the fire. Uh, once it was deemed safe, we then put crews into the roof uh, and the roof is just full of uh, mattresses and uh, old doodles, suitcases, a lot of junk. So it's a uh, long drawn out job just pulling things apart. But uh, the owner of the house is uh, all okay. He heard the popping noises. Uh, he didn't have a working smoke alarm. Uh, however, he does have an adjoining property and that did have one that was going off. So uh, crews are here from uh, Springvale, Dandenong, Keysborough Noble Park. So all in all, there's probably about uh, about 40 firefighters on scene, and uh, we just about used nearly all of them. So we, we had the wind uh, of the day, a bit of a gusty day, so the wind there helped us a little bit in, in regards to ventilation. It also uh, highlighted all the hot spots in the roof. So yeah, all good.